Hey guys, it's Melanie. Welcome back to my Christmas 2023 Decorate With Me series. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. We are going to tackle the family room mantle in this video. And this is definitely one of my favorite areas of our home. Um, it's right off the front door, so it is the first room that people see when they walk into our house. Um, this would be considered the, I guess you could say, formal living room. We do also put our big nine foot Christmas tree in here, which is, I guess you could say, the main tree. That is the tree that the presents go under. And this is the room where we uh, we open the presents on Christmas morning. So um, I definitely put a lot of effort into this particular space. Um, I love what the builders did back, <laughs> this house was built in 2002. I love what they did with this formal living room, especially by putting in this absolutely massive fireplace. We have really high ceilings in the downstairs and I think it totally made sense to put in this really super tall fireplace. I wanna say that um, the fireplace, at least the, the top of the mantle, that's probably six feet off the ground, so it's it's quite, it's quite a tall mantle, but it is definitely something that is a focal point in our home, and it truly is my favorite mantle to decorate throughout all of the seasons. So as you can see, I already went ahead and put the garland up on the mantle. One thing I wanna remind you of, and I'm just gonna zoom in here really quickly, is to really make sure that you attach the garland firmly <laughs> to the top of your mantle. The very last thing that you want to happen is for all of this to come crashing down. Um, if you are putting ornaments up on your mantle, if you are putting you know, candlesticks, all that stuff, it's, it's quite a bit of weight and you really wanna make sure that everything is secure. So I actually use uh, the command hooks to secure everything to the top of the fireplace. It has never damaged the finish um, of the paint or anything like that. So um, I just, I think the command hooks are definitely the way to go. And also don't forget to fluff your garland. <laughs> I wish I could link this garland for you, but I actually purchased this at uh, the flower market here in Portland where I live. Um, if you'll remember, I used to be a florist. <laughs> I'm currently taking a break from that profession, but um, I had access to some really, really beautiful garlands. This is the same garland that you will see on the mantle in the family room, but in here I doubled it up. So this is a much thicker, fluffier version, and it's because I used two of them together. So um, anyway, you guys, I have uh, a whole host of things that I'm going to be trying to incorporate into the mantle. Um, so I have some ornaments, some picks. Um, I also have some things here on the table. <laughs> so, um, it's really challenging for me to um, create different looks each year. I don't wanna do the same thing every single year. I use a lot of the same elements, but I try to use them differently. So this year I'd like to focus a little less on ornaments and a little bit more on picks. Um, I think that's also going to be easier to take all of this down at the end of the season. I'm not gonna lie, it takes me hours to clean this up after the holidays are all said and done. So um, this year, I wanna try to lighten up maybe some of the ornament usage, especially on the garlands. So um, yeah, let's see what kind of magic that we can create with this mantle this year. Um, yeah, grab yourself a cup of coffee, enjoy some soothing Christmas tunes and let's start decorating the family room.
right guys, just popping in here real quick to say that these three uh, brass bells are also going to be incorporated into the fireplace. They are going to be hanging off um, the front with some green velvet ribbon. However, the velvet ribbon has not yet arrived. So um, you will see the bells on the fireplace when I show you guys the finished final home tour. So, but anyway, let's go ahead and take a final peek at how everything turned out. <laughs> 